that was my son's graduation. He's graduating out of grade six. Yeah, it was a, a small gathering, but it was uh, super nice. You know what I mean? They enjoyed it themselves. And that's the most important part of it. So stay tuned, guys. Enjoy, okay? Please remember to subscribe, like, and share, alright?
，学业中取得更大的进步。谢谢大家。嗯好。呃，说呃呃 ，I hope 呃 everybody have a nice afternoon. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. This evening, so. Chairman of the Board, Ms. Valdir Brown, and members, distinguished guests, guest speaker, principal, teacher, parents, guardians, well-wishers, friends, ladies, and gentlemen, boys and girls, and my fellow graduates, a pleasant good afternoon to you all. I deem this an honor to be selected to speak on behalf of my fellow graduates. Today, I stand with mixed emotion we are close to our Karagape chapter. We are closing our Karagape chapter with this celebration, embarking on a new chapter, leaving behind our school family we love. Today, June 26, 2022, marks the day we come together as one to celebrate this phenomenal achievement for the class of 2022. This noble institution has still some morals in us with greater attributes and a wider scope of knowledge that will bring out the creativity that has been carved into us, helping us to pursue our dreams wherever we go. COVID-19. COVID-19 came, we were tested, pushed and pulled, but remained focused and driven. Here we are at the end game. Don't you all agree? Yes. yes. COVID-19 couldn't stop me. You, 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 you are, I am, I, you are, I am tomorrow's leaders, teachers, police officers, doctors, and other professions. As we move forward in this new chapter, it will bring forth a feeling of sadness, knowing we'll be in a different environment, surrounded by new faces and new challenges. But you know, we got this. We reminded that change is unavoidable. George Barnett Shaw once said, and I quote, progress is impossible without change, end quote. My fellow graduates, with God, all things are possible. So I stand here today and I thank God for bringing us this far, knowing he will continue to bring us further. To our teachers and principal who have nurtured us into what we have achieved and accomplished, to our parents who have made sacrifices and helped to motivate us, we thank you. My fellow graduates, go where you are planted and be the best you. Strive for excellence and remember, never to be a follower, but to always be a leader. I will not say goodbye because goodbye means going away, and going away means forgetting. So to my teachers, principal, and fellow graduates, I wouldn't wish to share this past year without you or in another institution. This institution became my home away from home, and I can proudly say that I'm a part and will always be a part of Cardabi, Child Care, Kindergarten, and Elementary School family. My final words before I march with my cool and fabulous classmates. We leave here today with tears in our eyes, but with victories in our hearts, ready to open new doors in the future. Deep breaths in, step on out, and let's start our new chapter. We did it, class of 2022. Yay! Are you know exactly what you want and need so believe? And you can never give up, you can reach your goal.
we will rejoice and be glad in it. We want to thank you, Lord, that we have come to another graduation ceremony at Karakati. And we pray your blessing upon our children as they go off to another phase of their life. May you bless them and keep them. May you protect them from harm. May you provide for the parents that they can continue to do the, the, the duty that they're supposed to do as responsible parents for their children. Lord, bless this afternoon ceremony. Bless those who are still on their way coming. Guide them with journey mercies. Lord, and we just, we just give you thanks. We give you praise that we can be at this time. After two years of much struggle, we can be here at another graduation. So we lift up your name, we bless you, and we give you thanks in Jesus' name. Amen. 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 This script is taken from Psalms 127, verse 3. Sons are a heritage from the Lord, children are a reward from you. This ends the reading of the Lord's word, and to that we say, thanks be to God. Amen. to be asked to give greetings to parents and guardians at the 2022 Paragraph graduation ceremony. I admit that writing this speech was even harder than writing my pep. Believe me, I would have never imagined that there would be anything harder than that. The hard part about it is that my, I was told my graduation speech had to make you laugh first, then cry, and then inspire you. And it had to be short. So, as you can see, that is not a very easy, easy task to accomplish, but I'll try. As I was thinking about this speech that represents all the graduates and reflected on my experiences here at Karagapi School, as a graduate, I came up here with the perfect knowledge, with the perfect words for my fellow graduates and I to see it. Thank you, Mom and Dad. Thank and effort that you have dedicated towards your students. On this special day, we express gratitude from basics. We will miss you as we exist this space of life and we truly love you. Parents, guardians, friends, family, teachers, well wishers, and guest speakers. Madam Principal and Chair. As you know, teachers are gifted to students. I am here to dedicate this tribute to one of our amazing teachers, Mr. Dale Ford, who has been our science, our students, his fine social teacher, and the public. Over time, we have got to know Mr. Ford.
teachers, Mr. Dilford and Mrs. Shamil Smith Williams, for everything you have done for us. My journey started in grade one to present. I got to realize some of the hidden of my hidden talents. There were things I can do from what I can do. Starting grade one, grade one, I cried, maybe because I was nervous or because my favorite cousin didn't start to with me. Time had passed and I got used to the environment and started to interact with others. I got my first embarrassing moment in grade two, which I'm not going to be talking about. Then I realized everything is getting harder as I move to higher grades. Grade four and five had passed. Grade COVID took me away from regular school and I repeated grade six. On the first day in grade six, I met this girl by the name of Friends Simons. We realized we had a lot in common, so we became friends. Until she migrated to the United States of America, and we lost contact. Then I met my first set of crazy friends, Tajay, Omitri, Vahim, Gabby, Catherine, Kimor, and Ikea. Tajay is a person who will always take her car keys and phones. The weirdest thing is that he knows Sir as to play by heart. Some of the foolishness I can recall him saying are things like, I does not do it or I does not take it. <laughs> Sometimes I will wonder where he got his English from. Then we have Omitri. Oops, I mean Mr. Greenhorn. He will annoy all of us for once to the entire day. Then we have Mas Bahim, or AKA Angelone's son. <laughs> he may look calm, but please, I beg of you, don't take him lightly. He's one of the students, the class disturbers, and our teacher will constantly talk to about the rocking of chairs. Then you see him tumb tumbling off the, the chairs gracefully. <laughs> Gabby, she's very funny and dramatic. I will advise you to listen to her lecture or you will see the dramatic side of her. Then we have this mad one, or should I say Kimoy. <laughs> she will always ask you to spell simple words like is, was, and an. This one time she asks what day is today one minute ago. Then the next minute she be asking what day is today. Then we have this abusive Catherine, who will always hit you. We are happy when she's absent. Then we have Ikea. She will always come up with silly ideas like putting lip gloss on the boys. She will always have this evil smile so we know she's up to nothing good. Transition to high school. To be honest, it's like going back to grade one which made me nervous. I know high school is harder than prep school. I don't want to leave this school. I have a lot of memories here. I just want to thank God for how far he has taken me and for this very long journey. Thank you for listening. This school, I met, I met a teacher named Antithea. She is a nice teacher. She helped me a lot to understand how to cope with my learning challenges. I also made a new friend, their name was Dashan Shamir and Aquino. I was placed in grade 5 when I started, now I am in grade 6. Mr. Farm and Mrs. Williams, they are my best teachers. Mr. Farm is, my, is a very strict but nice. He played with the class, with the class, and with our teacher, Mrs. Williams, teacher and Matt. She is a nice teacher. She is a very fun teacher. She helped me a lot. My time at choreography, child care, kindergarten, elementary school, my was my best. My name is Lee Mario Perry. All right. September.
So this is his last hurrah. Mr. Boys is sweet. And he introduced me to Eric. Yes, Eric. Eric has been a blessing to this school. And thank you, Mr. Swaby. And keep bringing them. You hear? Yes, I like the Chinese them. <laughs> I get free things. <laughs> so, Mr. Forbes. Come, please. Oh, Mr. Forbes. Yay. Come. And half of the things that the children said, there is more, you know. He tells them more. So this, oh, when Kara Kara is small, but when we do things, we do it good. I do not print paper certificates. Lord! <laughs> Tori Busto. Ashley Brown. Peter John Emmanuel Brown. Nobody block me, please. Jaden Daly. Where's Jaden, mommy? Omitri Graham. Vaheem Holness. And the person for the last, please get yourselves together. Dejanae Hibbert. Indira Jackson, Sean Paul Lewin, Tajay Livingston, Luke Linsu. Catherine McClymont, Gabrielle Mitchell, Good evening, Good evening, Good evening everyone. <laughs> I stand here today to thank God for life to celebrate with you all our graduation. Our wonderful, hardworking parents to who and took care of everything to make us happy. Miss Lonnie Palmer Carroll, our beautiful and inspirational guest speaker, for creating wonderful memories to our graduation. And I really thank the teachers, especially Mr. Ford for all the wonderful experiences we had. I can recall some hilarious moments. For example, when you look like you were feeling down, he would say, the woman left you. Which would make the whole class laugh. And sometimes the names he would call us, such as fire stick, Top man, eat a jump up bump all in the So then the whole class would laugh. I thank Miss William for being there when the class gets too noisy and out of control. And I really thank her for teaching us mentally and physically how to be here for herself. And last but not least, they call. You should be here with those men to give the vote of thanks. But because of his accident, he is unable yeah. to be standing here. And we thank God that he is alive and well right yes, now. Yes, yes, yes. Thank you, thank you. Thank you.
I want to thank God for protecting the Karagafi family throughout the years and, being, and keeping us safe. I am thanking my parents so much for being there for me during the years. Really? This point in my life. My teachers who taught us and for the support in one of the most difficult times. I am grateful, especially when Auntie Sean had to drop off and pick up the schoolwork, putting her life at risk. I am so appreciative. Words cannot, cannot express my gratitude. Accept my warmest thankful wishes for attending and making my graduation day special and a memorable. Your thoughtfulness is a gift I will forever treasure. Again, I say thank you. Miss Ajani Williamson, God has blessed you with an amazing voice. You have added a great memory to this extraordinary evening. Thank you. You don't know. Thank you all, Lord. Good evening, parents, guardians, family, friends, and principal, guest speaker, well wishers, fellow students, and staff. I would like to say thank you for coming to our lovely graduation. Thank you, Mother Cruz, for making ensuring everything was in place for us to celebrate, especially for securing a good sound system and presenting a clean and beautiful decorated auditorium. Thank you, teachers, for a productive school year. Amen. Jamaica, Jamaica. 